Welcome to episode 20. I feel like it's a celebration. We got some fireworks going, the moon's rising, city's looking sweet. Let's get right into this episode. All right, so here's the plan for the day. We, we got our forest industry. We got our farm industry. We got our oil. We don't have an oil industry. We got an ore industry. So what's next is oil. You can see we got some ugly ground here we called a dead ground oil corp. This is where we're going to dig to dig into the ground, find some oil, finish out those industries for the sock town. That will lead us to creating that transportation hub that I've been talking about where all of the factories are, all of the trains come in there. They take the items out of the city, make us mad profits, and we keep moving forward. Let's do this. All right, before we get started with this dead ground oil corporation, name makes me laugh. I love it. We're gonna have to do something about this. This entrance, uh, I already upgraded these to the industry roads in preparation, but this isn't gonna be able to handle the traffic. So let's let's pause the game. We're gonna have to rethink this. I like the angle. I think we'll copy what we kind of did or what was already done on the map over yonder. I was suspect of this. It's a smaller one, but I think if we make a larger version of this, we should be fine with the traffic. So let's get that going. We'll start out by just throwing some generic roads down here. We'll go out 90 on each of those and do the same. Let's go about right there. And then we'll do our roundabout tool plop that one down and that one and just for well I don't think there's a one way there is a one way industry road it's perfect so we can do this to help with the look of it or get rid of that and then of course we'll come in here we're gonna hold down is it shift? Yes. Hover over here, hold down shift. That fixes fixes the turn to just be one. It fixes the lanes to be one turn lane and one straight lane. Over here, we're going to leave these roads the way they are. We'll do the same thing. Oh, wrong button. I said shift, it's control. You hit control. Now, there's a way to do the whole road too. I think it might be shift control. I, I Let's see, let's hover over that. Control click, separate turning lanes. Alt click, separate turning lanes, one segment. Alt click. Interesting. All right, so next is gonna be, let's get rid of these. And we're gonna go with the, the smaller four lane road that we have. Go right to this spot and we're gonna go up to, let's go nine. How did that not line up? Oh, there we go. Should be able to get close and find that mark. Guideline tools are not helping us here. That doesn't look bad. Awesome. So this might be a little bit of an issue here. So let's go to our highway roads. Our two lane. Let's take a look at that one. What did they do exactly? Okay, so there's this, oh, okay. Very fancy. Very fancy. So that might be okay. Let's go one lane for now. We're gonna come out like that. And then we'll do this two lane into it. 
and reverse that. Obviously, it's going the wrong way. We'll go back to this one-way road. Oh, so that needs to be two-way. Nah. So this one should work. Perfect. That's not... That's a... I thought that was a two-lane. Oh, I'm losing my mind. All right, so we got to go to the small roads. We will grab this. No, nope, not that one. Oh, this one might be nice. There we go. All right. And then, of course, we don't really want this traffic just going like that. So we'll do that there. And then since we added that road, we have to fix this guy. All of these, huh? Thought I did that already. All right, and then same thing over here. This one will be a little bit longer. That's not an issue. Let's go like right here. Oop. Like so. And then let's grab this road that into it go back to our highway lane and like so and do some lane management and oops fix that as well that should get us prepared for the amount of traffic that we're going to expect in this area. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to figure out how to get this railroad up here and then we'll get cracking on the oil industry. All right, so I lied to you. We're going to actually get cracking on the oil industry right away. First thing we put down was the main building and some barracks for the employees to work in. And then I'm just spreading out the oil trails around the the oil area I, I looked at a lot of maps on google earth and i saw oil industry seemed to be spread out they didn't have the drills right on top of each other i assume that has to do with the way you drill oil from the ground i don't know anything about that that's why i spread them out there's not much that's sexy or awesome about this area so it's you know bear with me we get it going this is part of my big plan to have a booming economy in this city and it's 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 pretty successful i think we're gonna get all those factories going in the next episode but as you see we're just laying a ton of resources down to get a lot of those things out of the ground so we can make the plastics make the petroleum and then make some cars and all kinds of cool things with the factory All right, this next section here, we're working on our cargo train port. We got to add some train lines to get us to that area. I didn't want to bring the port or the cargo train station to the existing railroad line. I wanted to extend the railroad line into our oil area. And then we're going to work on the roads. We're going to do some one-way roads to allow traffic to come in and out cleanly from the cargo station or cargo terminal. And you'll see how that goes. Let me know if you like it or what you think about it.
All right, so now that we got everything laid down that we need in this area, we should be producing plenty of oil. We started playing around with some of the props and I'm not really sure how I wanna do with the detail here. So we're gonna leave that alone for now. That's about all I'm gonna do. I don't know if it needs it. I think the oil industry kind of is okay being plain. There's not much going on in the oil industry besides drilling oil. All right, I wanted to leave this episode with kind of an aerial view of the city we got so far. So we're going to zoom out and see as much of it as we can. Thanks for joining this episode. If you're liking what you're seeing and you want to see the city progress, please hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, turn on notifications so you can get notified and check out the next episode when I post it. The city's coming along great. See, there's a lot of empty space still for us to fill out. Next episode, we are going to attack that major factory industry or district that I've been talking about over and over again. Finally going to get to it. Super excited about that. I think it's going to turn out great. I'm anticipating it's going to cause some traffic issues, which I think will be fun to fix once we get to that part. We haven't really had to deal with much traffic yet in this city. We're still only around, I think, maybe close to 50,000 population. Coming up soon, we're gonna add a lot of neighborhoods, a lot more commercial areas. We're gonna get this city filled out nice now that we have all the infrastructure in place to make it an extremely profitable town. But again, thanks for joining. Hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments below what you think, if there's things I should add to the oil industry. Probably not gonna visit that area much moving forward. I just need it to do its job to get us some things out to be able to produce some cars and some cool factories and, and get that going. But again, thanks for joining and I'll catch you on the next episode of Socktown.